Proper ventilation in confined spaces isn't just about moving air, it's about keeping workers alive. In the next few minutes, we'll cover everything you need to know about ventilation systems in confined spaces, ensuring OSHA compliance and, most importantly, worker safety. Before any worker enters a confined space, proper ventilation must be established and maintained. OSHA standard 1926.1203 requires that atmospheric hazards be eliminated or controlled through ventilation. This isn't optional. It's a legal requirement that saves lives. There are two primary types of ventilation you'll encounter. Forced air ventilation pushes fresh air into the space, while exhaust ventilation pulls contaminated air out. In many cases, you'll need both. Your ventilation system must be powerful enough to maintain a safe atmosphere throughout the entire confined space, not just near the entrance. You'll need an industrial-grade blower or fan rated for confined space use. These aren't your ordinary shop fans. Look for equipment that meets OSHA requirements with a minimum capacity of four air changes per hour. The fan should have built-in grounding to prevent static electricity buildup, especially in potentially explosive atmospheres. Position the blower where it can draw clean air. Never place it near vehicle exhaust, chemical storage, or other contamination sources. The ductwork should reach the bottom of the space, as many harmful gases are heavier than air. Secure all equipment to prevent movement or disconnection during operation. Here's a simple way to calculate needed airflow. Multiply the space's length, width, and height to get cubic feet. Then multiply by four for minimum air changes per hour. For example, a space measuring 10 by 10 by 10 feet needs 4,000 cubic feet per hour of airflow. Always round up, never down. Ventilation alone isn't enough. You must verify it's working. Use a calibrated gas monitor to test the atmosphere at multiple levels, top, middle, and bottom. Test before entry and continuously during work. If the monitor alarms, evacuate immediately and reassess the ventilation setup. Never assume a space is safe just because a fan is running. Avoid these deadly mistakes. First, don't use too small a fan. Second, don't position ducting incorrectly. Third, don't forget to monitor air quality continuously. Fourth, never rely on natural ventilation alone. Weather affects ventilation effectiveness. Wind can help or hinder your setup. Rain can flood equipment. High temperatures may require additional airflow. Always factor in these environmental conditions when planning ventilation. If ventilation fails, evacuate immediately. Don't try to fix equipment while workers are in the space. Have a backup fan ready when possible. Practice emergency procedures regularly so everyone knows their role. Record all ventilation details on your confined space permit. Include equipment specifications, setup configuration, air monitoring results, and any adjustments made during the work. OSHA requires these records be maintained for at least one year. OSHA strongly recommends regular toolbox talks with your crew a few times per week. These frequent safety meetings reinforce proper procedures and keep safety at the forefront of everyone's mind. Make ventilation a regular topic in your rotation, especially when conducting confined space operations. Use SafeLieo to schedule and document these meetings, track attendance, and encourage open discussion about safety concerns. Create a culture where workers feel comfortable stopping work if ventilation systems aren't operating correctly. Consistent toolbox talks save lives. They're not just another checkbox. They're your best defense against accidents and injuries. Remember, every minute spent in safety discussions is an investment in your workers' lives and your company's future. Are you fed up with sifting through binders trying to find the right toolbox talk? Safe Leo can put an end to that headache once and for all. You'll never ever have to comb through binders again. Now you can easily upload your own or choose from our comprehensive library of preloaded text-based and video-based toolbox talks. No more last-minute scrambling to pull something together. Even better, you can bulk schedule those talks across all your projects ensuring they happen consistently without someone having to remember. When it's time for the safety meeting, just pull up the day's talk on your phone or tablet 
and deliver it to your crew. Taking attendance is a breeze too. Workers can digitally sign in right on the device or you can snap a photo of the physical sign-in sheet. Either way, Safelio keeps everything documented and stored in one organized system. Safety should be the top priority on any job site. Now you can streamline your toolbox talk so you can focus on the information, not scrambling to find it. Click the link below to request a quick demo.